Yo, what's up guys? Anthony Showtime Pettis here. What I started in Taekwondo was uh, my mother. She was a single parent, three boys. There was a training program in her college. We had a choice of ballet or Taekwondo as boys, so we were like, yeah, we're gonna choose Taekwondo. So it was forced upon me, man. And while she was in school, we would be doing Taekwondo for four or five hours a night, every night. So I hated Taekwondo when I first started. I uh, competed my whole life in Taekwondo. Um, that's actually how I got into mixed martial arts. So um, I started when I was five. I became a state champ at six years old. 10 years old was my first time being in the top 10. My instructor, Larry, he struck. I mean, he's the guy who first taught me business. He taught me um, Taekwondo. He taught me, and really in Taekwondo, it's about the life skills. Like we, you know, we definitely teach the martial arts, but the, the respect, the discipline, the self-esteem, like all that stuff is what kind of helped me get to this point. You know, I lost my dad when I was um, 16 years old in a house robbery. And I, I always say this, you know, without Taekwondo, I, I definitely wouldn't be in this position here. All right, for the butterfly kick, we can either go to the body or to the head on this kick, just depending on what the opponent's doing. But again, we're finding my rhythm, finding my range, stepping offline to make this turn happen quick. So when I'm moving, the way it looks is faint fakes. When I'm ready to go, go. Oh. I started as a points bar, so like the whole concept was to hit guys and not get hit, you know, so you score your points and, and get, get out of range. And uh, I brought that into the cage. You know, I think my style is flashy because of Taekwondo. All right, now we're gonna go to the head with this one. So same concept, I'm stepping off the center line, finding my hits to line up with my opponent. And once I find that knee, really this knee, wherever this knee points, that's where the kick goes. So when I'm moving, my knee's here, right off top. I was competing more for my students. You know, like when I, when I decided to open up a gym, um, you're teaching these concepts and teaching these skills to these students and their parents, and you know they want to they want to make sure it works. So yeah, I, I would always win first place in sparring because in Taekwondo you have to do two competitions. You got to do forms and then you got to do sparring. Um, forms I was not the best at, but sparring I was always a killer. You know I would always get first place. Next kick we're gonna do is a spin hook kick. So this comes from an orthodox stance. Same concept. I always want to line my hips up to make these spins easier. If you try to spin from here, it just doesn't work out. My favorite technique is the basics, man. Honestly, the, the reverse punch, the, the concepts of like how these movements actually work in real life. But I think my students' favorite technique is definitely the showtime kick. Every time I teach that kick, you know, everybody goes crazy. I mean, the showtime kick is actually the Taekwondo move. We would jump off walls and break boards for like demos, like to, to when we do de demonstrations in front of like schools and stuff. And, uh, you know, I think that's how I got the concept, but then landing it in the cage is why, you know, showtime was born. Nice left hand there from Pettis. Because most guards, they have it like this, so you're trying to get around that guard to get to the head. So when I'm doing this, again, turn and look, leg comes up, right around. But in fast motion, it happens a lot quicker. I think martial arts is good for everybody just based on the family it brings. You know, like I felt like I was part of something. In Taekwondo, you're training with a team of guys that want the same goal as you, and um, it kind of just gives you an outlet, really, especially as a young kid. You know, as a young kid, you know, I had a lot of energy to give. All right, so this one, we're gonna go to the body with it. Same concept, but instead of going over the guard to the head, I'm going straight to the body. So I like to set guys up, uh, fake it to the head, so they read it to the head, and I'm ready to go to the body. Same concept, I'm setting that foot up, turning, looking to the target, boom, right to the solar plex. So here I saw it looks, it's fast motion. The discipline, the self-esteem, the respect, you know, all that led to, to allowing me to be where I'm at right now today. Taekwondo was something that just made me feel like the man, you know, it was like my God-given skill that, that I was supposed to be in that position.